in to put naproxamine tubes, bilateral naproxamine tubes in a patient that's in the ICU. So this is realistic what you will look like when you can call back in because you don't know. <clears throat> you just don't call how we work. We work call back 24 hours, so 7 a till 7 a Monday morning. Sorry, my throat can't clear. Jesus. Probably because I just woke up. So I had to jump in the shower real quick, put on my stroke cap. I got a stocking cap up on my stroke cap because I don't have a wig on it or my hair did. So I just put a stocking cap on, threw my stroke cap on, no earrings, my wedding band, no nothing. Luckily, I got my eyelashes done and my eyebrows always stay waxed and cute. And then I just threw us a look while I was in and I'm headed to work. So this is what you call a realistic callback. You don't have time to put on makeup unless, unless you is called that and you're like out and about in the middle of the day, then I can see that you go in with your full face and blah, blah, blah. But if it's called back like this early in the morning, especially like 10 o'clock in the morning when we all called in at 7, had to be there by 10.45. Well, our technologist knew about it at 7 a.m. He didn't call the nurses, well, the nurse, which is me, until like 9 30 9 40 and we are planning to our radiologist is planning to stick or to do the procedure at 10 45 so all i had time to do is just take me a quick shower and lotion real good do what i had to do and then throw on clothes iron gloves throw on clothes and just go i could have just um paid for shrubs or got shrubs at work but i hate wrinkled shrubs it aggravates me the most. It looks like somebody just take the shrubs, ball them up, ball, bottle them up like paper, and then undo it, fold it, and put it out for us to get. It is ridiculous. It is hideous. And I refuse to walk around with wrinkled shrubs on. So, I usually just wear my shrubs home, wash them by themselves, and then iron them, and then hang them up.
believe it or not, at Walmart, we found a whole bunch of like little pieces to go on different areas in our home and eat. And we would have never thought that we would find that at Walmart, but they got some good deals, so don't, don't count Walmart out, guys. Check it out. And also, um, of course, Kirkland. We found a whole bunch of stuff in Kirkland. I found this pretty, 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 pretty clock in Kirkland, too. That was amazing. Um, yeah. Y'all can find some good deals, and especially Walmart. And Kirkland's at um, last weekend. I don't know if it's still going on now, but I had 30% off the entire store. And I also got some Christmas, like these two big initial Christmas ornaments to go on the front porch because I want to. I didn't want to do fall because I didn't want to decorate for fall or Thanksgiving because we're still trying to finish decorating the inside of the house. So I said, well, we'll just do all that by Christmas time. We should almost be complete with our home. We should be content with what we got. We, we probably should be adding like a couple pieces here and there. But for Christmas, I wanted to decorate the outside of the home and like throw some like throw pillows somewhere for the inside of the home for Christmas. Just to get the Christmas spirit and to get, you know, we should, we should be settled in the home by the end. But yeah. Mm. But it takes me so long to get everywhere for the first day. It's so good. Hopefully, me and my sister in can go to different stores if she's not in a rush. Go to different stores and get something to eat. Well, we're going to get something to eat first. We're going to different stores and look and like, um, we got a Pier 1 down here and the Hobby Lobby. I want to go in there because I got a 50% of our coupon for Hobby Lobby. So, I would like to go on Hobby Lobby and see what they have. And, uh, I see what oh, and I did want to go to Mac. I need to go to Mac. So, they, I need, really, I truly, I need to get all my empties together because I have a box up under my seat for all my Mac empties. Because, you know, if you get seven empties, you get one for item. So I have so much in that box, but every time I'm headed to the mall to go, I freaking forget it. Like I always, always forget that box. And then I'm now about to head out to the mall to Mac just to get a, um, a brow pencil because I use Spike. I use Spike and the Elf, the Elf brow kit, and then in, in the dark, and then I use Spike, the Mac pencil Spike the brows I use that as well to, to fill in my brows and today the only thing I had was my elf kit and my brows came out okay but I guess it's not something that I'm used to because I'm so used to using a combination of the two so I think I'm gonna have to go back
Good morning, guys. Today is October 4th, and I am finally starting my workout journey. I'm about to head and do some cardio with my sister-in-law. The same one I ate with yesterday at the Mexican restaurant. We decided to work out today. We'll start our workout journey. Um, we're not doing, I know the fat is keto, but we're not doing keto. We're just doing low carbs, low calories, low fat. Pretty much. Because I can't cut out carbs at all. I've tried it. I've tried it millions of times. i tried it for a month. I lost 18 pounds, but I have doubled because, double gaining that weight back because I got off of it and it, it wasn't for me it's just keto is just not for me hold on let me fix my camera well keto is just not for me that's just not something that my body could do i mean it's good so if you want to lose weight real quickly but to keep it off no because you're going to go back to eat some type of carb <laughs> so it's the whole world is made of carbs, pretty much. So I don't understand how people could be on a low carb, well, a no carb diet for years and years. I cannot do that. I've tried and it worked, but as soon as I start eating, introducing carbs back to my body, it didn't work. And plus, I stopped working out. <laughs> I stopped working out. I got real lazy. It was just. It, it just was a, a complete fail for me. But it's all good. I'm about to get back on my diet. Get back on working out. Today I start. As I tell anybody, I'm not going to be something on these dry big lips, honey. My lips are, I always say this to me, but I always laugh. My lips are too big. You walk around here dry. Mm -mm. Can't do it. Everybody always laughs when I say that. Because <laughs> it's true, here. Yeah. Just got on my Nike head and my. What you call it? What is it? Stocking cap? No, my stocking cap. My Nike head. It's where I got it in. No, it's a tank top with it. It's a real pretty. Um, Color that 
and then after we work out, we're supposed to be getting on. They have this keto smoothie. It's a keto smoothie at Smoothie King. But I'm pretty sure it's just low, cal low carb, low calorie. Because I'm pretty sure there is carbs in it. We'll see. I'll show y'all nutrition facts once we get finished walking. And that'll be, I guess that'll be my, my breakfast. Because I, I didn't eat breakfast this morning because I woke up at 8. And it didn't give me enough time to eat before I worked out. And I do not like eating like really, really heavy before I work out. Because I feel nauseous when I work out. So, I didn't eat. Costa Rica or chestnut, 
I always, before I put it on, I put on my Too Faced lip injection um, lip gloss and let it sit for the entire time I'm doing my makeup so I can get my lips like real juicy. My lips are already juicy. But I feel as though it's not like juicy in certain spots. So I just put it all over my lips and oh my God, that is the best, the best look. That is the best look. <laughs> so, sitting in bed, chilling, watching TV, um, watching my favorite person, my favorite YouTuber. Her name is Ashley Devana. Let's see if I can spin this camera around so y'all can see her. There she is. I love her to death. I watch her every Sunday when she put out as to I actually I love it. But let me turn it off before I copyright it. But uh, yeah. Just chilling, just happy to drink my mimosa. It's definitely gone. Um, this is just melted ice, but it is gone. It was delicious. I do want another one, but not. So, just chilling in the bed. I take off all this makeup. I just already took off my hair. <laughs> and uh, I'm going to sleep, I guess. I'm about to just go to the basement so my eyes can go down there about you. But not doing nothing on this Sunday. Church was amazing. Mm. My exercise walk was amazing when I went my first one today that I did not record at all. Oh, it was a lot. But anyway, anywho, just rambling. I'm going to let y'all go. Today is October 6th. So, two more days to my birthday. I'm going to see what we're going to do with my birthday. Probably nothing. I'm working. <laughs> I'm working with focus on that weekend. My friend's Christmas wedding this Saturday. So I know that morning my son got a game, then Christmas wedding, and then we supposed to go out that night for my birthday. So it's gonna be a long Saturday. But anywho, I will catch y'all, you guys, later, probably tomorrow, cause I'm about to go to bed. <laughs>
let's not talk about the interstate, but me and a few cars. <laughs> I will catch y'all in a little while.
so I just finished getting my brows and my lashes done. I got a full set of lashes, so it took a minute, but that's done now. It's complete feel and look like a whole different woman. My brows are done, they're tinted. Um, and now I'm headed to the nail shop because I have had this color, this lime color, slime color, whatever you want to call it, for like two weeks now. So I usually get my nails done every two weeks and this has to go. And my toes been white. I do like white toes, but I don't like them like everybody else do. Everybody else like it, keep their toes white year round or every other set there's white, their toes are white. white. And I don't like that. I like different colors. I pretty much like my nails and toes to match. I don't like them to really mismatch unless it's white. Then I'll go with a color. My, nails a different color than my toes and my toes are pretty much always white if I mismatch but other than that I never mismatch my nails and my toes always match so the issue today is I don't know what freaking color to choose because usually I have a color in mind and I don't have a color in mind today I don't know what color I'm getting today so we're gonna see what color once I get there I choose a color I only get gel polish I don't get SNS I don't get nothing else I just get acrylic lay on top of my real nails and then I get gel nails so I'm headed there now if I haven't said that before once I get there I will record once I get there so this pretty much is a <laughs> pamper me Saturday. This pretty much is a pamper me Saturday. I got my nails and toes. I'm getting my nails and toes done. I got my lash brow done. My hair is already done. So it's time to spend my Saturday. We'll probably go out to dinner or something later today. So I just want to prepare, be prepared and ready to do that. So I will record once I get there. I'm good. How are you? I'm grand. What can I get for you? Um, I want a. Oh, let's see. I want a crispy grilled cheese. Uh, I do need to make sure that we still have those grilled cheese today. But while I'm looking for the grilled cheese, what can I get you to drink? Um, I want a grande caramel frappuccino, please. A grande caramel frappuccino. Yes. Yes, ma'am. And then. Look like we did have that grilled cheese. Anything else? Nope, that's it. Crispy grilled cheese. Nice and toasty. <laughs> and that grande caramel frappuccino. Yes. We will have that ready for you at the window and it will be 11.45. Okay, thank you. That's why I can't lose weight. Let me get shit here. <sighs> this is why. This is why. My shirt trying to choke me. Thank you. Thank you.
Thank you. Have a wonderful day. You too.
31st. It is Halloween. I'm just getting off work. Just went to the mall to pick up my computer. Now, um, I am on my way home. Um, need, needless to say, my, my computer been in the shop since the 3rd of October. It is still not fixed at all. Not at all. So I still, the sound still doesn't work. It's going to be another 700 and some odd dollars for my computer to be fixed. Um, and remind you, just last year, I got the motherboard replaced and they're saying that it needs to be replaced again. I haven't had my computer, a, I think a little bit over a year. And it's just, Apple's just, ugh. It's like once their products tear up and you try to get it fixed, it's like something continuously goes wrong with it. And it is so aggravating. So, bad. So, I don't know. I'm just over it. I'm over Apple products at this present moment because I have to pay 700 and some odd dollars to get it fixed, which is aggravating. So, I want to keep everything compatible, like my computer and my phone, when I record my videos on. I just want to keep everything compatible, but I don't know if I want to pay another $700 for my computer to get fixed. And I darn sure don't want to buy another one, which is only $300 more. So, why am I keep spending almost $700 once a year when I can just get a brand new one for $300 more? It's just, ugh. And I don't want to spend that type of money right now because we just bought our house and we furnished our we furnished our entire house. Everything in my house is brand new. We didn't bring nothing with us from my old home. Everything is brand new. Furniture, everything is brand spanking new, and we paid cash money for it. So, and that's what me and my husband saved for. So, it is what it is. But. I just don't want to at this time to go back in my savings and take another lump sum out. I just don't want to do that. But it seems like that's what I'm have to do in order to get my computer. Well, not computer, but to get my. Um, sorry, I'm driving on the interstate and I'm trying to look and see what this car is doing in front of me. I lost my train of thought, but I just don't want to take any money out of my account right now. I just don't want to do that. I'm building my savings back up. So, it is what it is. I don't know. I'll probably just continue to edit on my phone like I've been doing until like January or after Christmas. And then I'll get a computer because, I mean, we got Christmas coming up for the boys. It's for the boys, Christmas. It's just so much going on. And right now, I just don't want to spend $700 for a computer. That's ridiculous. Oh my God. I'm going to have to do this again. It pisses me off. Trying to let that make my day back. <laughs> that cannot make my day back. Like this, this whole ordeal. I've been doing good with my phone, so I just continue acting like the computer don't even freaking exist at this moment. Let me down with it. But I am on my way home. It is raining again on Halloween. It's been raining all day. My son's football game has been canceled again for the third time. We've been trying to play this this same football game since last Saturday. Today is Thursday. It's been canceled because of the weather. The weather is terrible here in Georgia. So, uh, so I don't know when they're gonna reschedule. I have I have made adjustment on my work schedules just so that I can come. And every time I do, it likes it it backfires on me because we're not even doing it. We're not even. He's not even having the freaking games as of the rain. So, hopefully they'll have it by Saturday. Hopefully they win. Hopefully they win. They've been good. They've been doing good all season. I just need to keep going. So, you guys, I am about to head home, like I said before. And I will catch y'all in that. Well, I'm not catch y'all in that, but I will talk to y'all pretty soon. But my husband wants to go to Red Lobster tonight on Halloween. He wants 
to go to Red Lobster tonight. And I'm like, what about the kids? Like, my eight year old, he still likes to go trick or treat. He got his mask in the mail because I ordered it and it just came today because he just picked it out like a day or two ago. Amazon is clutch, y'all. Let me tell y'all. So, we ordered it on Amazon Monday and it came in today. Well, no, we ordered on Amazon Tuesday and it came in today. That's how that went. Sure did. So, Amazon is clutch. If y'all don't have Amazon Prime, I don't know where y'all at or uh, what y'all do with y'all life, but it ain't right because Amazon is the business. But, um, he was asking, my son was asking where was his mask and I was like, I don't know, did they not deliver it? And then he was like, well, it's a yellow, um, it's a, a yellow envelope on the table, in the kitchen table. I was like, well, open it, see if your mask. And if it is, put it on. See what you look like. But my husband is still saying, I want to go out to eat for it. I want to go out to eat tonight. I want to go get some fish from Red Lobster. And I'm like, oh, really? So, I will tell y'all what we're going to do when we get home. Hopefully, we can do both real quick. Take my son for Halloween trick-or-treat and then right after that, go out to eat. And then come back home. But, I will catch y'all back in a jiffy. Five ten.